hi everyone welcome to another video and in this week's video we're going to be comparing the three devices in the hot 4 series of phones from infinix we have the hot 4 Lite, the hot 4 pro and the hot 4 now for this particular video i want you guys to keep in mind that the black phone is going to be the hot 4 Lite, the hot 4 is the golden device and the hot 4 pro is the gray device now when you place these devices beside each other they may look identical but if you take a closer look you start to notice the differences number one is the fingerprint sensor which you have on both the hot 4 and the hot 4 pro but on the hot 4 lights we have no fingerprint sensor all the other differences between these three phones are internal so let's start with the first one the hot 4 and the hot 4 light have no 4g support only the hot 4 pro supports 4g lte networks secondly the hot 4 pro has a superior camera to the hot 4 and the hot 4 light the hot 4 and the hot 4 light come with an 8 megapixel primary camera while the hot 4 pro comes with a 13 megapixel primary camera and all the secondary cameras on all three devices are 5 megapixels respectively now the third internal difference between these three devices is that the hot 4 light is the only device out of these three that comes with a 1 gig ram the Hot 4 and the Hot 4 Pro both comes with 2 gigs of RAM. Now when it comes to hands-on experiences, the Hot 4 Lite is actually quite okay. It has a bit of heft to it and according to the Infinix website, all 4 devices are 175 grams, but they kind of feel a little bit heavier. Now the Hot 4 feels exactly identical to the Hot 4 Lite, bar the fingerprint sensor that is not on the Hot 4 Lite and they both have this kind of rough bumpy exterior at the back now the hot 4 pro is the only one with the grainy finish at the back so i guess it's the only one that feels kind of different to hold compared to the hot 4 and the hot 4 pro but all these devices in weight feel identical so you might not be able to tell the difference now when we open CPU-Z to check out the real specs of the internals of the phones, I was shocked to find out that the processor on the Infinix Hot 4 Pro was different from that on the Hot 4 and the Hot 4 Lite. The Hot 4 and the Hot 4 Lite come with a MediaTek 6580 processor running at 1.30 GHz, while the Hot 4 Pro has a MediaTek MT67 35 processor which runs at a lower clock speed of 1.25 gigahertz the gpu on the hot 4 and the hot 4 Lite is a mali 400 mp gpu renderer while the one on the hot 4 pro is a mali t720 gpu renderer now as you can also see all three devices run at hd resolutions and only the infinix hot 4 Lite has a 1 gig ram once again, here are all the specs just in case. Now, my final thought on these three devices is that the Hot 4 series has always been a budget series for Infinix with the hot s being the only exception because it has a lot of premium functions but um i feel these phones have done what they set out to do like they're just supposed to be budget phones with some recent additions like the fingerprint sensors which was, which is on the hot 4 pro and the hot 4 i've seen them flying off the shelves but because there are three devices released very quickly beside each other a lot of people get confused about which is which which has what and which which doesn't have features that they need so i hope this video has cleared up some of the confusion at least some of it and thank you guys for watching this video subscribe to the channel to help me out like this video if you like it and see you guys next time